everybody, I'm Dee. And I'm Jay. And, and we, we are Parent and DJ. DJ. Welcome to MSC Maravilla Part 2. We're still here. Ooh, the <laughs> Yacht Club Edition. So ah. If you missed our last uh, adventure, we just did four days in the standard mm -hmm. Bella Balcony experience on this ship and talked about that. Yeah. Now we have three days in Yacht Club. Yeah, and um, it comes with all the bells and whistles, so you guys can stay tuned and see what that's all about. We'll kind of go over everything that's included with your price tag, which is not bad, truthfully, no. for everything that it comes with. We'll get into that. Yeah. We'll tell you how much we paid and all that stuff a yes. little later on. Keep you in suspense, because <laughs> we did pay full fare for we this did. Yacht Club we sailing. Did. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that's all I know. Technically, we have already completed some of our day, mm -hmm. but let's throw it back because we didn't really have time to say hey this morning and get you caught up to where we are now. Do it. Roll that beautiful yacht footage. <laughs> Phase one, visit guest services and get our new cruise cards. Oh, they have a special desk over here to the side just for back-to-back -back processing. Woo -woo. Well, we just got our new key cards and our Yacht Club wristbands. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we have a new assembly station too, obviously. And a sentence I don't get to say that often. They said they will send a butler down to help us collect our bags. And I guess go ahead and at least move our bags to Yacht Club. So. We told them we'd do it. They said no. I know. I was like, we can move them. We can do the thing. But that's not how Yacht Club works. Luckily, it's all carry-on. Super easy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we are on the move. No, oh, they will bring us to the left. Welcome officially to Yacht Club. <laughs> First steps in Yacht Club. No, we don't. <laughs> Maybe we do do that. <laughs> Snacks and breakfasty things here in the top sale. All right, well, he said for us to enjoy the little spread here, hang out, and they will probably come take us down to do our, because we do have to do a walk off, walk on, and go back through immigration and stuff. We got fruits, we got pastries. Fun. So yeah, they've got debarkation going on in here right now. We'll do a little bit more looking around as things empty out. A little piano, bar area. You get views right off the front of the ship as they clean them winders. We got coffees with milk or cream and sweeteners. We're living a sweet life now. No, we're not in a sweet, but it's like sweet. Okay, it's fine. Right, let's sample this fine Italian coffee. I'm pretty sure this is espresso made into an Americano because um, it's potent. It's good though. I put enough. Oh, it's got yeah. some back. Yeah, it's, it's very, so I'll wake you up. It is tasty. It's good. It's mm -hmm. strong like me. I'll be like running all over this place in a minute. <laughs> Alright, they have come to retrieve us. It's time to head ashore and do this back to back process here with immigration and customs. <gasps> They've taken our snacks away, but I think we'll get some lunch snacks later. Oh, there's some stairs. I know they got sparkly stairs in here. There's like the concierge desk. Oh, this is about as quiet. Oh, what have they done? Oh, they did like a goodbye thing in the uh, Galleria. That's the correct word I'm finally using, not promenade. I like that. Hey guys, here's a bumbly ship tour. Look at that, chocolate. <laughs> Yacht Club desk's priority. Whoops, security. Just got scanned out. Away we go. Ooh, look at all them goodies. All right, no recording in the terminal. We'll tell you about it on the other side. Oh gosh, that's bumbly footage. First steps back on board Maravilia. Oh, anticipated. The ramp is too long. Nice. Well, that was super painless. We just had to do the facial recognition and get processed back in, and then boom, right back on board. We're getting that gelato restock here at Crepes and Gelato. Holy craps, that gelato. Okay, I made that joke last time. Just wandering through a ghost ship right now. <laughs> Welcome back to 16. <laughs> Well, they've got a kiosk right here. We're curious to see what the shows are on the three-day. Ah, theater shows. Are there any duplicates? I hope so. Yeah, welcome aboard. One day more. Born to rock. Yeah, that's it. So basically, they cut out Journey. Okay, so all the shows are duplicates. So we might look at doing one of the pay shows since we have seen all four of these shows. Oh, they're getting some welcome cocktails ready. Nice. Fruit punch, pineapple juice, prosecco. All right. I know. Look at her. She's like, Thank Prosecco, you. please. I love Prosecco. 
There's a full bar up there. They got a whole range of tea and stuff down here. They've already um, restocked the lunchy type snacks. Look at this, they got the arancini. Mini arancini with mozzarella. Let's go under the glass. Sweet peppers, olives, artichokes, nuts and chips. Oh, and raisins. Well, Miss Prosecco, let's just hang out in here for a while, I guess. We are going to venture up. Let's go to 19. I think that's going to be our pool. Yes, indeed. Welcome to deck 19. There is a pool. Whoa. I've never seen automatic doors before. <laughs> wow, this area is nice. I don't want a dirty towel. No, okay. Here's towels. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we got to basket this before anybody gets up here. There was only one other couple back to backing with us and they did not come right back to yacht club. So we pretty much have this area to ourselves because I would say very few people board a ship prepared to swim. So we're on it. Well, look at me and reflected in the shower. Four feet, six inches, pool and whirlpool gloriousness. Aha. Yeah, I like the uh, little benchy boothy things. There's lots of little things up to provide shade. That must be the restaurant maybe over on that side because those look like eating chairs. Yeah, so hopefully we haven't seen any hours or anything, but this should be open. So ladder entry. Oh, are you making refreshing noises? How's it doing? All right, half the pool has some sun. Half the pool has some shade since my sunglasses and sunscreen are packed. I'm gonna be living in this area, so. It's, it's nice temperature. Oh, the water is warm. I'm saying this is definitely heated. It's Holy heated, moly. Yeah. Yacht club, I guess they call this the one pool, right? Like we were used to in Divina. So I'm gonna call it, it says sun deck and bar. I'm gonna refer to it as the one pool. So one pool spin. Uh, this is how to do a back to back day right here. Yeah, very relaxed. Wow. No stress. Uh-uh. Love it. Yeah, there's a lifeguard chair. We'll do an outward spin. We just need to bask in everything we can bask in while we have this to ourselves. <laughs> oh, here's where they keep their D's and fancy pool. Hello. <laughs> Look, you can even have some fishy friends on the wall. Okay. All right, we are gonna migrate to the hot tub. We've been in here for a good little bit. Okay, so from the pool, you have to go up and around these stairs and then over there and in the entrance, Oh, it's the same temperature as the pool almost? No, no, it's warmer. Okay, and then <laughs> in through the other side over there. So let's do it. So that side has uh, at least one more shower. Looks like two showers actually, restrooms. And then here's the steps up. Seven maximum bathers in the old coral pool. Let's see, really there's all of the, gosh, that's glary. Children under 16 must be accompanied by an adult. They're gonna fit seven people in this hot tub. Or two very tall people. That's right. <laughs> Ah, yeah, this is relaxing. Nice. Bubble mode, activate. <laughs> it is nice and warm in here, I gotta say. It's not hot, but no. it's definitely warmer than the pool. It feels good, I don't like it when it's like boiling hot. This is nice. Good night, y'all. This is where we'll be if you need us. <laughs> Very nice. We are done with hot tub mode. We have spent our 15-ish minutes in here according to the sign, and now we're gonna motivate onward. Now let's wander over here. It's about quarter to 12, so I think we'll get over, at least grab some water, maybe see if they got some food going. We got a little high top tables over here, low top tables. We saw the smoking section over on the other side. There's some nice undercover tables. Uh, this is the grill and bar, which is not quite up and running yet, but that will be some food. Water mode. Look at fancy ice cubes. fancy ice cubes. Let's see what we're working with. All right, we got roasted potatoes, grilled shrimp. There's some sea bass back there. Hello. Pork, beef, shrimp. They got burgers and cheeseburgers to order. Oh, carving station. What's happening? Angus beef filet. We got meats and cheeses and grapes. A little salad. Oh, look at all those salad bar toppings. Dressings. What's our soup? Oh, it doesn't say. Bread. What's hiding in there? Okay. And of course, salted and unsalted butter. Nice. Little desserts and fruits over at this bar. Ooh. Yeah, they're doing pasta to order up there. Of course, like I said, the hamburgers and cheeseburgers are made to order. I just grabbed some pasta salad, tater salad. It was cream of pea soup. 
There we go. Oh, minute steak, potatoes, veg, fritters, shrimp, beef stew. Ooh. We also got some steak and some shrimp. Steak and shrimp, a little bit of salad, a little bow tie pasta, lentils, and some bread. Well rounded meal. <laughs> Well, the cabin should definitely be ready. Let's wander in and see. So this is Babylon deck, and this elevator gets us access, uh, yeah, from 19, 18, 16, and I guess 14. Well, there is our luggage, and there is our cabin. Let's see if our band works. Oh, Because sure. my cards are packed, so. Ooh. So you know what? Let's do a cabin tour. We are in a standard yacht club interior. Let's peek at it. Let us begin from the door. There's all of our safety information. Now, right here, this should be a bathroom. So, oh, yes it is. Y'all, we have a shower. Okay, now, if you watched our previous little Maravilia, it was a bathtub. It was, didn't like. So, I, I'm already impressed there. Okay, here's our, oh, yep, yeah, that's gonna be cool. Sink. Me, of course. What do we have? Two. Oh, they got the cool stuff. Guys, let's come in here. Man, my phone keeps hitting everything. Um, all this lotions and like a, what is that, shower caps and things there. Nice. Two shelves. There was two hooks on the door also. Let's come back out of the bathroom. All right, so from the bathroom, oh yeah, we've got like our little key card activated light switch, our makeup room and do not disturb switches, thermostat, oh good, which is already set to bar cold. I did that. Nice. Um, <laughs> here's where they keep their D's, of course, in this Hi. chair. Oh, uh, there's our bed. Get in here for a full examination. So, oh, it keeps going around. Okay, so TV is in this little nook. We've also got part of our mini bar and our snacks in here. Nice, and they refill this, <clears throat> I guess, as many times as we need, yeah? No, I think it's a one-time refill. Oh, for the drinks, too? Yeah. I thought that, well, that. we'll learn. I thought they bring you as many bottles of liquid as you want, oh, but yeah, the actual the snacks. Energy, I think the snacks is one time. Correct, yeah. okay, that's what I was thinking. Not like there's not enough food around here. That is true, all right, our closet opens like this. Oh, oh my <sighs> word. There we go, drawers, safe, <laughs> it's like a, a hairbrush? I don't know. It's a brush. Shoe shine brush, maybe. Robes, hangies, top storage. It's not awful. A lot of hankers, though. Next to the closet, we've got the mini bar. Well, let's dig in here while we're at it. So, mini bar, fridge, which I totally know how to open. We got Sprite, Coke, tonic water, sun kissed. Oh, wow. Lemon iced tea, peach iced tea. Looks like cranberry juice, grape juice. Okay. Solid. Yeah. Up top, we've got lots of glassware and tongs with an ice bucket. There's a little room service menu. We do have two, like 110, 120 style outlets. There's a USB with some 220s. All of our paperwork on the bed. Big mirror. Mirror D. <laughs> She's not as nice as regular D. That's true. She's mean. <laughs> Telephone. Artwork. Now, what are these fancy little um, bedside lights we got going over there? Some sort of like deflector panels? <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it doesn't really move or do anything fancy. There's a little <laughs> book light and stuff. Let me clean my fingerprints off of there. Don't see any power solutions over here, but that's okay. A bedside table with two cubbies. Oh, that's real dark. Camera, let's lighten that up. Yeah. There's our luggage mat. All this bedding. Now, Dee knows the fancy words <laughs> about the bed. Tell me about the bed. So the Yacht Club beds are like a step above the standard bed. So it's Egyptian cotton sheets, a pillow top mattress, and then they give you like a pillow menu. So if you like firmer or softer pillows, you can let them know. We usually just go with whatever's in the room. So should be a very comfy night's sleep for three nights. Yeah, <laughs> nice. All right, I've got my booty against the front door. So one more look at the room. Nice. I can deal with that. Side note, room service in here should be included, whereas our Bella level uh, room last time was not included. And this was a little thing where you can actually order newspapers delivered to your cabin. So that's kind of cool. Lots of languages, lots of countries. Hmm. Ooh, the lighting in here is a little creepy too. We got these like ceiling spotlights going on. Anyway, we are going to settle in, get partially unpacked, whatever we need for three days, you know. Um, we're still trying to figure out, do we need to do a muster drill since we are back to back? Our muster station changed and I think we're probably going to have to do one. We may just do it anyway, just for fun, because it is fun. 
Um, but yeah, let's just get ready for the rest of our day and we'll see y'all in a while. Good afternoon, afternoon and happy fresh and clean time for me. Um, we are in the cabin. We still need to go figure out um, about mustard. mustard drill. I think yeah. we've talked about that. So we're going to go ask some questions and get some answers. Mm -hmm. And yacht some glub. <laughs> we've unpacked. We got our nice little magnetic hooks on the wall you can see. Yeah. Guys, those are in our Amazon shop. All right, I'm going to stop talking about it. Parodj.com slash Amazon. Yeah, so this is the interior room, which is, it is smaller than the balcony that we were in, but still ample and the most affordable way to be in the yacht club. So yeah, we definitely really. wanted to show that to you. Yeah. All right, well, let's yeah. get out of here All right. um, and do some stuff. Okay. Cause here's desk is on deck 16 and so are we, which is awesome. That was my song for now. I think this is it. It's an emergency exit, oh. I don't think We're learning. Yeah, I see it out here. We just asked and they said we do not need to do the muster station. As long as we understand that our new muster station is in the theater, we are good to go. <gasps> There's one. <laughs> One sad little fresh fruit tartlet left. No, I don't need a snack, but anyway. Oh, here's some raisins and some nuts. <laughs> oh, there we go, loading us up with more snacks now. I don't need those, I gotta save my appetite for dinner. All right, we got a ham and cheese sandwich loaf, cucumber dill cream cheese, chocolate chip cookies. There's some more cookies, eclairs, brown bread roll with Roma tomatoes, mozzarella, lettuce, a balsamic glaze, or with potato salad, truffle, and caviar. Now I have cured the old beverage menu. 13 pages of goodness. Wine, beers, and ciders. Gosh, we don't need to look at all this, but there's all kinds of fun stuff on here. Okay, what is this fanciness you've got here, ma'am? The Hemingway Dactarines. I have to remember what it is. <laughs> a little bit of six toed cats and. No. Oh, no. I have got a rusty nail with bourbon. Oh man, because they got the gold rushes on here, but they also got the rusty nails. Okay. So what did this end up being? So it's rum, lime juice, grapefruit juice, and maraschino liquor. Liqueur. Liqueur. Okay. So it sounds sour and slightly sweet. Like me. <laughs> Not sour. <laughs> Jay is making me try it. Nasty, nasty. It is delicious. It has bourbon and drambuie. It does not stink. That is the wonderfulest concoction. Yuck. Wow. It tastes like like cleaning solution is like I imagine that Delicious. Would How often do you drink cleaning solution? I imagine it tastes Okay. Like, ugh. No, I'll stick with it. Well, they've just made the announcement for everybody to go back to their cabins to watch the safety video so the place is cleared out. This is weird being exempt from like a muster drill, but anyway, I'll take it. we'll take it. We'll just bask and see some Port Canaveral out the window. Oh my gosh, look at Dee getting in the way. What, are you blocking my Port Canaveral shot? Ha! Uh. <laughs> All right, we're gonna head back to the cabin anyway, knock out a little bit of work. I feel weird not being in the cabin during muster drill. Yeah, we should be, no, if we continue on to the left. I don't think that's our door, is it? That's an electrical locker. Let's don't go in there, it's over here. Yeah, it should be around the corner here, symmetrically on either side. There we are. Oh, uh, passenger alleyway. Okay. Yeah. Let's, let's try it. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Holy moly. Help. Should you hear this signal, please follow the instructions that will be shown in the safety video. Now, please confirm you have watched the safety video by dialing 881. Good evening. Hey, again. We are still here. Yeah. Um, we are getting ready to go to dinner, our first dinner in the Yacht Club restaurant. Yes, I'm excited. I do enjoy that this ship, I guess, was kind of purpose built for Yacht Club mm -hmm. so that the restaurant is literally one floor up yeah. from where we are. It's kind of cool. They have everything like all in the front section, yeah. which is really neat. So, I mean, Davina was fun, but mm -hmm. you had to walk a long way back to get to that I restaurant. Like to it. You could get outside and look at You stuff. probably need some steps. That's yes. true. But we're gonna go to the restaurant. Actually, I guess we'll just go chill out for a while because it's not quite dinner time. Dinner not opens yet. at six. Um, Maybe watch, hopefully. I don't think we're sailing away until yeah. we're at dinner though. Probably not gonna move till then. But yeah. anyway, let's go hang out mm -hmm. and eat some food. Sounds good. <laughs> Secret access door. Let me get some more Port Canaveral views while we sit here. 
that's not a good one. Oh, you don't like these? <laughs> well, no, no. Oh, right the sunshine. Sun. You're right. Now I'm not looking at the sun. Ah! Let's go up the fancy stairs. So dinner starts at 6. We're a couple of minutes early. Yacht Club Restaurant. Oh, they've got actual washi washi station. It's very nice. View off the front of the ship. Yeah, we'll get some sail away views from Port Canaveral as we dine. They've given us paper menus, but you know what? I'm just gonna put the digital menu because I think it's easier to read. Thank you. Ooh, bread time. Yeah, yeah, just, just one. They loaded me up with bread. Mm-hmm. We've got some Sauvignon Blanc working. Now we just get to watch the sunset and sail away. So pretty. I mean, double whammy, right? Wow, jazzy tunes. <laughs> Officially sailing away. We have just wrapped up our dinner. It only took about 45 minutes for us to be served and complete dinner. And we are off for adventure. Oh, there was all that cheese. Back down the shiny stairs. We are gonna go out into the world and get ready to see a show here in a little bit. Welcome to the Galleria. Now we're told that there is coffee over here at the chocolate place and it is included in our drink package. Oh, very nice, all these sculptures. This will order down here. Oh, they have a whole menu of spirit coffees. All right, you know I see whiskey on the menu, I'm like, what? Update to the update. The drinks at the coffee shop are not included in any drink packages. But we're getting them anyway because they sounded delicious. <laughs> anyway, we're sitting in a little booth over here by the window. We see the pilot boat out the window. Good gracious, the camera doesn't want to focus. Anyway, so there may be some bars that do include coffee, but the coffee here at this particular establishment is not included. Here's where they keep their reflection mirror D's. Oh gosh, that was a weird that was a weird reflection. <laughs> D has gone with the German spirit, which has Kirschwasser in it. That's good. That's a cherry liqueur, right? So that's yes. probably pretty good. I got the American spirit, which of course is bourbon. Wow. Well, that face says a lot. How's yours doing? It's very strong. Some sort of liquor. <laughs> it's good. Wow. But it's like, the coffee is already bitter, and then alcohol is like kind of zingy, I guess. So. Zingy coffee. It's very strong. They do not skip on it. So if you're paying for it, you definitely get what you paid for, right? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that was quite the pick me up. <laughs> All right, let's roll. Oh, they're getting ready for the ABBA party again later. That's right. We are going to jump up to deck seven. Oh, we got saxophone tunes here in the atrium. We're gonna head to the back of deck seven because we have got a show reservation. Now they are showing cool, which is the same welcome aboard show we saw last cruise, but we have got reservations for Rock Circus, which is the $18 show. Comes with a drink. Uh-huh. And um, there's like lots of acrobatics, so we wanna see if we can show it to you. True. 
Rock Circus. And they do have a special Yacht Club priority line. Welcome to the Carousel Theater officially. Ah, uh, there is the cocktail, I guess it's included. You just grab whatever you like. The one the pink, the yellow one is Ralph. There we go. Look at all this rock circus. We've got like show in the round. We've got some nice sort of centered backish seats so my big head doesn't block anybody. Nice. Well, D has chosen the rum based cocktail. I have chosen the vodka based cocktail. So this is included with the $18 ticket price. So. Ready to go. And they have a virgin option as well. True. So you don't have to get something with alcohol, obviously. Are you ready to rock? Yeah. Rock on in circles. That's right. That's spin. That's like rocking on in a circle. I'm excited because this is like what MSC is known for is like the strength facts and the different things. So yeah. even though it's $18, it's not a bad deal because it comes with a drink. So I'm really hyped to see it. And I hope we can show it to you guys. Yeah, we're listening for announcements. I'm hoping we can record. So. Yeah. <laughs> Flash photography is not permitted, and we ask that you stay seated during this production as artists will be performing all around you. Now, get ready to rock! Whoa, they must be paying the lighting guy overtime. Holy moly! <laughs> saxophone still going on out here well we're gonna see if there's any other entertainment happening maybe we can catch some music in the pub or something but we got to wind up through here and get to the other side of deck seven yeah the app lists music over here as of eight o'clock which was an hour ago but he's they're either on break now or done <laughs> yeah let's sneak in here anyway shall we y'all the pub guitarist just showed back up from his break wishes have been answered. This is awesome. I'm ready for it. Ooh, he is rocking that looper pedal. You got to Watchtower, princess get to 
Enjoy your drinks in the meantime. Thank you very much. Ooh, he's going on a break for now. <laughs> Tore it up though. Back out into the world. Oh, we've come back out to the Galleria. Is that the right word? We got a little bar set up down there. The ABBA show and party. I guess it is more of a party than a show. Is coming soon. Try and show it from a different perspective. True. <laughs> Let's ABBA party. Yeah. Oh, they said they were doing a thing called Ceilings of the World. We missed that last time. Oh, yeah, we can learn stuff. Oh, yeah, if I pan over here, it actually shows you where the things are. Wow. Taj Mahal. Welcome aboard party. Fun fact, this is not ABBA, but it's cool. We got dancers on the bridge down there. Ooh, it's the 70s warm up to the ABBA party. Y'all, this is, this is not a, a 70s song. I don't, I don't think Whitney was doing this in the 70s. Wait a minute now. I dropped it. All right, we figured that out, didn't we? We're professionals, okay. Welcome back to my reflection in the top sale lounge. Oh, we got piano tunes, yes. We've come back to the cabin to find, I believe they gave us some candy. Those are giant. Wow, they're big. We got our papers for tomorrow, and then this was our cards from the previous cruise we had to turn in at guest services, and they said we'd get to keep them as a souvenir from last time, so woohoo. This is a creme brulee chocolate and a pistachio chocolate, y'all. This, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Creme brulee, woo, chocolate. We have not tasted them yet. Like, I keep thinking this is a watch. It's not, it's just a wristband. <laughs> it's about 11.30, so we're going to bed. Guess what, we're gonna be in Ocean Key tomorrow. Yay. But we get to go to the Yacht Club side and do the Yacht Club stuff. Still snorkeling. <laughs> Yeah, all right, so let's start. All right, you know we're saving dinner for last because that's just what we do. Mm -hmm. uh, let's start with, I guess we'll talk about the show, right? That's the major yeah. thing that we did. So we paid uh, $18 each to go to the show. And I mean, overall, I thought the show was fairly solid. The folks were very talented. Yeah. 
There were some technical issues. I felt, and I mean, it's probably just choices they made. I felt like parts of it were very dark that I was trying to watch when people are yeah, spinning things. Yeah, there was like things. really cool acrobatics happening. And I don't know if it was just where we were sitting. I, no, I don't know. No, so. they were it was in like the dark. It was really dark and they were spinning. And I was like, oh, that would be so cool. But right. you couldn't really see it. You can see on camera, I'm trying to like capture things. <laughs> And it was dark sometimes. And they're mega talented, but unfortunately you couldn't see it. Huh. And then like the sound was a little muffled sometimes. Yeah. I don't know. So the I'm music overpowered the vocals. Yes. But he was good. Like all of the energy was there and yeah. they were very, very talented. They were doing what they were doing. Technical kind of like got in the way, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, I sat there and I was like toward the end of it and even all night long I've been sitting there thinking, you know, is it worth the eighteen dollars? And I mean I guess I'll say it is worth yeah. the eighteen dollars. But I wish some of the technical stuff had been better. Mm -hmm. True. So, and I don't think it matters where you sit, honestly. No. Yeah. That's it. So that's my review of the show. What else have we got to talk about? Um, Besides dinner. Just you know. the Yacht Club experience in general. Okay. Service has been phenomenal. Yeah. No issues whatsoever. Everybody already knows our names. Oh, gosh, yeah. Like, um, you know, they wanted to learn them immediately. Mm -hmm. And we've made really good relationships. And service has been spot on. Dinner was super fast. Sure, we're not talking about that about yet. Sure, yet. That's later. So fast. Um, yeah, I have nothing but good things to say about it. So I feel like I'm on a whole different ship. <laughs> yeah. I literally feel like I got off the Meraviglia and I've moved to the Meraviglia Plus. <laughs> But that's the whole point of the Yacht Club. Isn't you get what it? you pay for, right? Yeah. yeah that's how it, it is works. literally a different world. Yeah. Let's talk about dinner. So let's jump. You started with your scallops. Oh my gosh. So refreshing. Cooked perfectly. No complaints. The papadam is really nice and crispy and had that like little salt piece that you needed for that. Salt it was piece. so delicious. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I had the uh, dim sum mm -hmm. and they were fried. I was expecting a dim sum usually I think is like uh, uh, like soft? Steamed? Uh, yeah, steamed. Yeah. Good words. I know, right? <laughs> this was kind of like fried and crunchy, but it was delightful. The sauce was a little mm -hmm. spicy. Everything in it tasted good. Even, mm -hmm. I, you know what? I ate the salad underneath it. All the vegetables, <laughs> and they were all good. Uh, you had a salad. It was called a co uh, I think it was called like a cob salad. I don't okay. know that I would classify it as a cob salad. I know, I'm looking at the picture. There's not much cobby. Like a basic salad with lots of really good vegetables and like a lime dressing. So it was really delicious and I missed vegetables. So I was very happy to see it. It was a very big portion and I was happy to have it. <laughs> yeah. Um, I had now speaking of portions, I had the terrine, which it was one <laughs> slice of a terrine. So it was very small. It was tasty though. Cause I think it was what chicken and duck. I'm trying to remember. Back. It, this is, that's, that's what it looks like. Um, yeah, I'll see that it's screen like white screen. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure by this point I've started putting up pictures with, we talk about dinner because you know this dinner segment is expanding yeah. as we go it was good i will say i like the little balsamic drizzle around the edge the terrine itself was flavored well it came with a nice crispy piece of bread i have no complaints yeah. about that terrine um let's move on to your giant tuna oh my gosh one of the best tuna steaks i have ever had and it came with like just like some potatoes very simple but like perfectly done it was absolutely delicious. No complaints whatsoever. I tasted it. it he had some. Yeah, it was good. really good. It was real good. I had the pasta. The pasta was cooked well. Now, granted, mm -hmm. it was literally four. I thought it was tortellini, but I guess it was like tort. Mm -hmm. Like ravioli? Teeny. It was bigger. Uh, whatever it's called. Yeah, there were four of them, but they were cooked well. It was mm -hmm. al dente. Everything in it tasted good. The sauce was good. I sopped it up with some bread. <laughs> hmm, that's how that went. You had an apple thing. Uh, There's no sugar added apple cobbler. I could not yeah. tell you it was no sugar added. It mm. was delicious. No complaints whatsoever. And I had a cheese plate. Anytime I get cheese, blue cheese especially, delicious. I mean, it had, let me look at it. It had like apricots it had like fig jam it had a hunk of a fig all kinds of cheese yeah. and she told him she would bring him more blue cheese she if did. he wanted so. i did not want because i was full this is the best meal i've had um on this ship yeah guaranteed and but it was like 45 50 minutes because we so told them fast. we had a show to go to and we yeah. just wanted to make sure we were done in time we were way done in time it yeah. was awesome why did we just get dark anyway I don't know. camera's going to sleep oh we're late again um <laughs> Yeah, yeah, club. Good gracious. It's very good so far. Yeah, and you know, we're not sponsored by MSC. No, we paid our way on this yacht club. Yeah. I don't know why I feel compelled to tell you that because we, you know, usually buy all our cruises. 
but we paid rack rate. Oh, I guess we'll go ahead and get into that too. May as well, first day, right? So right. Um, this one was rack rate. Mm -hmm. And I want to say on average, including gratuities and all that stuff, it ended up being, I say about $250 per person per day. Correct. Three day cruise, about $1,500. It includes a lot right. though. So it includes, you know, the premium drink package, two device Wi-Fi per person. True. Um, the separate restaurant, the pool, the hot tub, the restaurant upstairs, which is like the one pool. They have breakfast yeah. and lunch up there. Um, the nicer bed and the room is 50% oh, bigger. Oh, it looks fluffy. I'm trying to think. Room service is included. True. There's Where's a lot that's included. LA I know I'm not. missing something. We'll put a list up somewhere. Sure. No, he won't. No, I won't. I probably didn't. Um, I forget. Oh, oh, yeah, special but special seating in the shows if you go oh, to the regular shows. And special well. line to get into the mm -hmm. paid shows anyway. There's a lot that's included in there it, honestly. There is. This and is then, one of the most comprehensive and affordable, like, ship within a ship programs. It is the most affordable of any cruise line. Okay. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, but compared to like the normal MSC experience where you'll normally get away, maybe even with gratuities, you're typically under a hundred bucks a day yeah. to cruise on MSC. So you're going to, let's just say a hundred bucks a day versus like 250 a day per person. All of that's right. per person. It depends on what you're interested in. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, it's an upcharge, but good gosh, are we having a good time? <laughs> so far, so good. <laughs> Two more days to go. So yeah, we talked long we enough. Talked um, We're going to bed on our very, very comfortable bed, <laughs> mind you. It looks so good. See you in Ocean Key tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow. Woohoo! <laughs> Bye.